Well, the first thing is if you don't know the answer, generally don't fake it. Um, you, you, you don't necessarily have to come out and say, well, I don't know the answer. Um, but if you watch enough politicians, you know, you could ask a politician what time of day it is and somehow or another, you know, they're talking about something that has nothing to do with what time of day it is. They're talking about, well, for lunch I had a bacon, lettuce, and tomato, da 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 And so sometimes if you're comfortable, you know, with the question, you don't know the answer, you can take that sort of political tack to um, try to take the question and move it into an area that you feel a little bit more confident on. Um, I think that, you know, when you do know the answer, that's an easy question. And, um, and that affords you the opportunity then to not only answer the question, but then maybe elaborate and reinforce what you've been trying to say. So you can say things like, that was a really great question, it's 12 o'clock, and the point of my speech is that you really need to be reticent about the time, and this just gives us another one of those great examples of you know, why you need to know that. Um, so then you can use that opportunity to reinforce what you're trying to communicate.